Hi guys, this is me. I'm Kelvin from Kelvin.com. In today's session, I will guide you how to source for a cheap VPS, a small VPS for your email marketing server. Some we sometimes we call it as a SMTP server or SMTP VPS server. Okay, I would like to introduce you two website. The first one will be this low end talk. Low end talk is a forum kind of uh, VPS uh, discussion. Uh, if you are looking for web hosting, reseller web hosting, VPS or dedicated server, you can actually uh, post your question over there here, and a lot of uh, expert will uh, help you on that. Take an example. This guy is looking for 16 core 32 GB RAM Windows VPS. You can just post here. It is he's actually putting in request. Some you are uh, actually uh, asking for help. Uh, some is for announcement and uh, we can see a lot of uh, different topic over here and the second website that i wish to introduce you is called as a low end box in this low end box website there is a lot of uh, good offer from here take example this is the latest one 21st june 2019 uh, this uh, how to set up your cron job on vps this is just a tutorial a information website Take example, this company name Strong Server Strong. He offer two GB, four GB, six GB, with twenty five USD per year in Los Angeles, and you can see uh, the the date is on June twenty first. Is also the latest date, which is today, and uh, this is kind of uh, offer they provide over here. Uh, the the pricing can be as low as you can't imagine it. Uh, it depends whether it's good or bad on the services you might need to do some review uh, search for some background look for some uh, forum whether this company is good or bad take for example this company is offer DCN host 200, G 200 GB and 400 GB master reseller plan they are actually selling reseller plan not VPS and you can see this company is actually selling the uh, as low as 19 USD per year is pretty pretty cheap and this is all their plan 19 USD per year 29 per year is based on uh, basically we are looking for the uh, IP address and the CPU core together with the RAM this uh, this for example this offer offer is 2G RAM this is 4G RAM uh, with all this price is pretty pretty cheap and you can search a lot of companies some is reputable some is not and you also can see a lot of review online okay next i managed to find one company and i make the purchase already i received the email on the login password next we coming for the vps control panel this is just a new vps that i just log in their control panel is this my temporary domain name that i registered with this vps control panel and this is the ip address they assign for me okay in order for you to at the first time you log into this uh, vps control panel what you need to do is check the ip address whether it's been backlisted or not because if you are looking for very cheap vps somehow they will give you a bad ip which you after you set up your smtp server your email will actually go into others recipient spam folder which is not good so uh, go open on a google and just put in like ip blacklist checker and there is tone of website over here can actually help you to do uh, ip checking so just take the three or four or five even five uh, website from the top five and you just uh, check on your ip address and uh, this is my favorite site which is mx toolbox i just uh, copy the ip address and put it into my uh, mx toolbox and just uh, make a blacklist check the system itself will actually help you to cross check your ip toward different kind of spam filtering server and we, as we can see all is green color okay everything is okay all this is on those uh, uh, different kind of uh, spam server some we know some i ne never even heard about it and as you can see all is green color right so uh, let's make another check on 
uh, the other website example this is what in my what is my ip.com they also provide uh, blacklist checking ip address blacklist check and you put in your ip you click check and you can see all these details all the list name the host name and the, is it listed no not listed everything is uh my ip is not listed toward all the spam filter and the spam list and also the spam host and uh, another website dnsbl and i can see that i might be i might have one blacklisted over here so if you have such blacklisted you might contact your vps service provider and get them to uh, whitelist your ip address from this uh, from this website so uh, another uh, good website that i wish to check is this cisco talos you can just put your ip address over here and it will show you your email reputation is neutral your web reputation is neutral so let's say if you are using this server to make a, a bulk email sending and uh, once uh, a while later uh, might have a lot of people click on spam and your email reputation might be poor and let's say if your email keep on going into the the other email uh, recipient and all the reader is reading your email without clicking spam and all these result will come here and it will show your email reputation good once your email reputation become good your email will very high chance drop into other recipient inbox so uh, this is the web reputation some even some website even doing some scamming or whatever then uh, people is reporting so you will see it's a poor or uh, some of the website is giving good you can even test your current web server example you are using any uh, share hosting you can even try it and check it over here so i think that's all for my lesson for today uh, how to source for a good vbs by using a uh, low end talk uh, low end box over here and your vps checking your ip address and as you can see that uh, right now from this uh, vps control panel uh, i have this uh, uh, one os is centos 6 is uh, installing over here and this is my memory consumption is very very low and this is my space is low, very low so after we install our SMTP server let's see again in the next session and see how much is consumed basically for the SMTP server uh, I will recommend 512 MB uh, megabyte uh, RAM will be sufficient uh, for this package I grab a very good deal 1G uh, memory uh, with less than 10 USD uh, per year okay uh, i will see you in the next session goodbye